Hello everybody, my name is Dr. Arpan Mohamik. I am presently working as a scientist in Indian Agricultural Statistics Research Institute, New Delhi, under the umbrella of Indian Council of Agricultural Research in Ministry of Agriculture and Farmers Welfare, Government of India. Today I am making this video on a special request from one of my junior, Dr. Bipin Kumar, who is presently working as a scientist in Indian Agricultural Research Institute, New Delhi, and doing a fantastic job in promoting agricultural education through his YouTube channel. So this video is mainly concerned with the career opportunities in the field of agricultural statistics. So when we say agricultural statistics, the first thing which come into my mind is that when you can go for agricultural statistics. So you can study agricultural statistics in your MSc and PhD. So after graduation, you can uh, get direct entry in MSc or PhD level in different state agricultural university or central agricultural university or through ICR exam. That is ICR used to conduct all India basis exam in UG level and PG level, uh, PG level for MSc and also for PhD. So you can apply those type of exam and you can get chance in uh, different uh, state agriculture university or central agriculture university to study uh, and deemed university also obviously so to study agriculture statistics course. ISRI Indian Agricultural Statistics Research Institute is a premier institute in the field of agricultural statistics computing and computer application and bioinformatics but they as such do not, do not provide the degree in the field of agriculture statistics computer and bioinformatics whatever degree whatever students are earning degrees from isri that those degree are mainly under the umbrella of pg school iri so the students are pg school uh, students of pg school iri but they used to study their courses in I indian agricultural statistics research institute now once you do your msc and phd next thing is what to do now the, since you studied agricultural statistics, don't worry, you are having ample of opportunities in your career. The first opportunity that which, which come in my mind is agricultural research service. The service in which I am presently uh, serving my organization. So this service is conducted by uh, agricultural scientist recruitment board. So this service, the eligibility criteria nowadays is PhD. So this service is, uh, you have to appear the uh, preliminary examination through written uh, preliminary and main examination through written examination and obviously interview. So this is a very wonderful job. You are having lucrative career if you get selected in agricultural research service. Then next, nowadays the trend is Indian statistical service which is conducted by Union Public Service Commission, so uh, UPSC. So Indian statistical service nowadays recent trend, this is the recent trend uh, students are going uh, to uh, this service. So mainly the eligibility criteria is BSc statistics but since we are from agricultural statistics background so the eligibility criteria for us it is MSc agricultural statistics and now uh, this this Indian statistical service you have to appear in a three days rigorous exam of various statistical paper along with genetic general studies and uh, English and after that you have to appear in interview so you, you can if you get selected it is a uh, gadgeted officer post so you, you will you will be recruited in the post of level 10 so now apart from that there are lo ample opportunities in the field of assistant professor from different agriculture universities, state agriculture universities or central agriculture universities, mainly the recruitment are based on uh, interviews, so mainly the eligibility criteria is MSc. So apart from that, different states also conducted, also recruit assistant professor in different colleges other than agricultural colleges also. So uh, for example, Uttar Pradesh Higher Education uh, Service Commission, they recently recruited uh, in different post of uh, assistant professor for their different colleges in the field of agricultural statistics west bengal also they have recruited uh, statistics assistant professor for different colleges in uh, statistics but they are agriculture statistics are also eligible some of my stu or upward student also uh, got job in that field apart from that you can get uh, you can get the job in the form of assistant statistical officer for different agricultural department in different states. For example, recently Rajasthan Public Service Commission, they have notified the post of an, uh, statistical officer for agricultural department and different uh, students from our ISRI, they got the job also. Now, apart from that, seal, Central Seal Board uh, under Ministry of Textile, they also recruit in the category of Scientist B. So mainly the recruitment is based on interview. So people are also joining in that post. That is also a very lucrative service. Apart from that, uh, Indian Pace Research Organization, that is ISRO, they also used to recruit in the field of Scientist. Uh, for MSc, it is the category is SC and for PhD, I think the category is HD. So, uh, but the desirability criteria for ISRO is 
that some knowledge regarding GIS or remote sensing application but agricultural statistics they recently they have recruited the post with desirability criteria in, in the form of GIS or remote sensing so apart from that RBI the premier bank in India Reserve Bank of India they also used to recruit post in the uh, field of research officer in grade B for their department of statistics and information management so the procedure for RBI is you have to appear in uh, written examination and then you have to appear in interview also. So apart from that Indian Meteorological Department they also uh, used to notify in over ta different time interval for scientist B and C post in Indian Meteorological Department and also recently uh, last year I have seen one, inter one advertisement where they used to notify, uh, they used to recruit, they have recruited uh, in the post of agricultural statistics for scientist C level. So apart from that since nowadays statistics is in huge demand so people who are having good uh, program skills particularly R, Python so which are open access software and if you are having good uh, program skill you can uh, be hired in different private companies with huge amount of salary so that is a very uh, good opportunity in the form of data scientists they used to hire lot of companies our uh, colleagues are our students junior and senior are they are in different companies so I would like to mention some of the companies like Accenture Aristocrat uh, Gaming, Cognizant, TCS, uh, The Economist and etc. A lot of companies are there. They used to uh, hire or recruit uh, the statisticians where the agricultural statistics uh, people also used to go. Our students, they have uh, chosen the private the uh, path for private company in the form of data analyst or data scientist. Besides CGIR Institute also, they used to also hire uh, agricultural statistician in the form of data scientist or biometrician these are the some of the direct uh, of career opportunities opportunity which i am highlighting apart from that there are some temporary opportunities are also there like uh, the, if you are uh, from agricultural statistics background you can be uh, accommodated in the form of ra or srf in different projects spawned the funded by different government bodies or private uh, agencies so these are the time bound uh, these are time bound job a temporary job but the salaries are also uh, good Apart from that, uh, these are the direct, uh, I think these are the direct uh, opportunities you will get in uh, agricultural statistics. Apart from that, some other indirect opportunities are also there. In, you can opt the career for uh, banking sector, you can opt the career for ADO, ADA and the different state government and uh, peoples are also going from agricultural statistics in the field of ADA and ADO in different states government. Then uh, even in civil service also you can uh, opt one paper in the first statistics. So uh, you can see lot of ample opportunities are there. Statistics is very is a very good subject. Very uh, pro means it is having high prospect. So if you learn the subject statistics, if you love the subject statistics, I am sure you will definitely get a good career, definitely get good job, and you will be uh, definitely successful. Although success, getting a job and becoming successful is different, getting a job, anybody can get job if he, if he or she study the subject in a very disciplined manner and if, if, if they used to provide a lot of hard work on their uh, effort. But after getting job, success is totally different. You have to maintain, uh, you have to continue gain the knowledge in that you have to, and otherwise the path of success is a bit difficult. So if you are studying the subject very well and if you love the subject, you will definitely get the uh, job. So with this, uh, I would like to thank Dr. Bipin for giving me the opportunity to highlight uh, the important career opportunities uh, for the subject agricultural statistics. So I wish if you love the subject, you will get definitely a good job. So I hope all the listeners who are or viewers who are watching my video, if they are in, interested in taking agricultural statistics as their subjects or so you have to I, I am wishing them all the best you have to study well so you can get job beside this i will finish my uh, speech with a small message that you know nowadays uh, corona virus that is due to covid 19 it is taking pandemic shape uh, in the entire world so be safe be sh stay home so maintain social distance and pray to god so that we can get uh, relief from this pandemics thank you very much